top of the morning, YouTube family. What a day outside. Peep this. Mm. It's that time of the year, man. In Oregon. January, February, and Oregon. It's probably... It's, it's an interesting time of the year. For those of you that know, it's just, you know what I'm saying, 20 degrees, raining, frozen, um, all bad. Not very good at all. Like I said though, man, top of the morning. I got a little bit of new gear, okay? A little bit of new gear, you know what I'm saying, uh, to make y'all's experience just a little better. Um, a little better quality, you know what I'm saying? And without you guys, I wouldn't have been able to get this stuff. So I appreciate that as always, man. It's a Monday. This is the third week in a row that I've filmed on a Monday. Um, I got a new video from to come out this week on Instagram. Go follow me there. Check that out. Um, I hope the audio is okay though, y'all boys. It's my first time using the mic, so. If it sounds crazy, I apologize. Well, as an athlete, um, a question I kind of get a lot is like, bro, how do you maintain, uh, you know, being an athlete, having friends, having a social life, and handling school? Um, and I, I think a lot of times it depends on, you know, the person and how busy you are as an athlete or what sports you play, because some sports involve less time put into the, uh, sport itself as others but you know I think as as an athlete especially one that's in college um, it's really important that you have a, a balance and be able to balance you know things that you do because you don't just want to focus on sports all the time 24 7 um, and you can't because you have to handle school and then you know if you want friends if you want to have a little bit of social life do the things you want to do you got to do that too so um, yeah, this is kind of what that video is on, you know what I'm saying? For those of you who uh, have that question, um, you know, we're going to go through that. So I'm going to take y'all through the day and show y'all what I do to try to maintain and balance this football, school, and social life as a college athlete. Yeah, first part of the day, it's 7.40 in the morning. Um, we got workouts at 8 a.m. So... Let's go get a, uh, let's go get better. Good morning. Let's get that shit Top going. of the morning. Come on. Top of the morning, let's get it going. <laughs> She fine, she freaky, she cool, she from East Atlanta. Good little day at work, man. Um, now we finna head home. All right, maybe. <laughs> Good little day at work, though. You know, the usual workouts, uh, recovery, stuff like that. I got class today at, <clears throat> I got class today at three. It's 12.45 right now. Um, so, workout. Where? I don't know. That's hard, though. Eee. Hey, whoever car this is at Oregon State, if you watch these videos, let me uh, let me take a drive. <laughs> <laughs> what you were saying, bro? <laughs> I was looking at a memory. Yeah. I remember when my shit ain't had no tin on the windshield. Ooh. I was looking through my shit. You not fishballing no more, huh? Hate them for the fishball on the windshield. What? What is that? Like, fifteen? No, that's thirty-five. I'm good though, don't it? Yeah. Okay. My shit dirty right now. Though. Yeah, 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 yeah. This one's way better, I think. Mm. No, no. Now look at this. But yeah, good little start to the day. That's how my days usually start. Um, with workouts, and then I do treatment, get some food. I'm not that hungry today, so I'm, I don't know what I'm eating right now. I might get some at home. But um, 
yeah, now we finna go home for a little bit. Um, do things I gotta do before class, and then we head to class, so, yeah. We back at the crib. Um, we got a little bit of time to spare before class starts. It's two o'clock right now. I shower and stuff. I take a long time showering, so. You know, maintaining um, social life, football, school, um, it can be easy, it can be hard, depending on, you know, what you do and uh, how you spend your time um, when it comes to just handling things you gotta handle as an adult, as a college athlete, as a student, as somebody who's trying to, you know, do something in their life, wanna have friends, all this stuff. So, because it's Monday, um, uh, the first thing that I usually do um, when I get back to my house, and because it's Monday, I, uh, I write down what I gotta do for the week. Um, as far as, you know, homework, uh, schoolwork, meetings I got, appointments, PT, you know, I write down everything I need to write down. Um, and it helps because I think that when you start, when you organize what you have to do, it makes it to where um, you know what you have to do during this time and you know what you gotta do during that time. If you just jot down what you need to do um, for the week, for the whole week, Monday through Friday, it will significantly help you um, organize uh, all your stuff. And even I'll get on my computer and even re-go over um, my assignments for the week uh, as far as school. Now me, um, I'm a senior, you know what I'm saying? So I'm finna graduate. So right now I'm only in like two classes. When I was a freshman and I was first getting in, getting into school and I had a bunch of classes, I had all these in-person classes and stuff, I was really unorganized. And it, uh, it, it kind of affected, you know, my grades. It affected how I was outside of things because I just, I wasn't organized. I didn't, I didn't have everything situated. I would get in trouble a lot. Not a lot, but sometimes, you know, I'd miss tutoring sessions because I didn't remember I had one. And because of that, I'm outside 6 a.m., you know, rolling around. You know what I'm saying? And I was at Georgia. That I wasn't even at Oregon State at that time. So like that that shit was serious. You know what I'm saying? So um it's good to do it, you know. A lot of people are like, well, just 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 have everything in your head, you know, you're a dude, like you don't need to jot down your your notes and organize yourself. You do. You do. As a man, as a as somebody who if you want to be productive, if you want to be successful, you need to organize everything that you have going on and playing the things out that you have going on. So, um, so in the long run, you know what you're doing. But yeah, that's the first part of the day. Um, now, we go to class. Really not supposed to be parking in this lot because I don't have a pass, but look, it's a spot for me every day. Why would I not take advantage of it? I ain't get a ticket yet. Knock on wood. I don't have any wood, so. I ain't getting no ticket yet though, so. Boys, I might be cooked. Every car in here got a ticket on it. I don't know. Maybe they're, uh, maybe they ain't come by yet though. Or maybe they're, maybe they already did their rounds for the day. Maybe, I don't know. I might be cooked. This is not a part of the uh, um, how to handle uh, school and social life and ball. Don't 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 be like me and just park anywhere. Cause I know the ticket lady personally because we we didn't got so many arguments. Like for real. I didn't show y'all the fisky of the day though. Some slight. It's like 60 degrees outside, so it's not that cold. Got the shorts. Got the hoodie. Nothing crazy. Nothing crazy. I'm not gonna lie though. I don't like this walk at all. But I'm gonna be on time today. It's 2.50 right now. Class starts at three. It's about a five minute walk, six minute walk. So I'm gonna be on time. Be on time to class. Um, that's another thing of just like being able to balance out your, uh, damn. It's another part of being able to balance out, you know what I'm saying? Your school life and social life and stuff. Don't be late to class, cause that's how you get in trouble. 
especially if you a young buck. You know what I'm saying? I'm a vet, so I got a little bit more leniency, but don't be late to class, man. Class was cool, nothing crazy. You know what I'm saying? All my studious stuff. But now we are about to go, um, I gotta go pick up this sample hoodie. Me and my roommate are actually starting a clothing brand. You feel me? And it's not no like, it's not no Makaya Tongue merch, none of that kind of stuff. It's like, it's like real clothes, real nice clothes you can like wear, and, you know, stuff like that. I'm saying go follow the clothing brand uh, Instagram. Cause we are dropping, we are dropping soon. It's gonna be like some streetwear kind of stuff. So, you know what I'm saying? If you like streetwear, if you like to, you know what I'm saying, look fly like me, go uh go follow the um the loafwear Instagram. And uh we're gonna have stuff coming soon. We're gonna have like pre-order stuff coming real soon, like within the next month or two. So go follow it. Um yeah. We're gonna go pick up this first sample hoodie and uh and see what it's looking like from our uh from our guy. So yeah. You dig? Just a sneak peek. Just a sneak peek. Just a sneak peek. You know what I'm saying? Just picked up the uh the hoodie. I already got it on. I already put it on. You know what I'm saying? Um, shout out my boy Wyatt out here in Corvallis. You know what I'm saying? Um, we got some we got some good stuff on the way, man. We got some heat on the way. So make sure y'all go follow the Loafwear Instagram if you wanna if you wanna if you wanna be fly. If you don't wanna be fly, don't follow it. But, you know what I'm saying? You want to dress nice and look good. And, uh, you know what I'm saying? Your girlfriend, your mama, your granddad asking, where you, where, where you got that hoodie? Where you got that t-shirt? You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying. Co-workers, random people. You know what I'm saying? They all going to be asking you. So, we got a meeting with our graphic designer for the company, for the brand, um, to go over some more heat. And, uh, yeah. See what's going on the rest of the night. You hear me? Let me show y'all what I'm working with, though. It's called Korean barbecue. Yes, indeed. Got the chicken katsu. You feel me? And we got the uh, the scrimp, the scrimp fried rice. You know what I'm saying the bussers, per usual. Yeah, man, got our little business meeting done. Um, I just brushed my teeth, washed my face. <clears throat> Sorry today's video was a little shorter, but you know, we got more content coming soon. So don't worry, do not worry. Um, consistent 2024, I got ideas, I'm jotting them down, more content. Um, and, you know, just more vlogs, you know what I'm saying? Y'all enjoy the vlogs, so I'm gonna just be picking up the camera and just filming. But yeah, that's that's, that's the video today, man. Uh, stay organized, bro. That's just the big thing. If you want to keep, you know what I'm saying, if you want to maintain having a social life, playing football, doing school, uh, stay organized, you know what I'm saying? Choose your time wisely, you know what I'm saying? When you got time to do something, you got time to just sit around. Um, it's okay to sit around, you know, to chill a little bit, take breaks, but when you need to, you know what I'm saying, do your work, study your plays, do what you got to do so you can enjoy rest of the day and you can enjoy going to college bro so yeah man that's the video um i'm gonna catch y'all on the next one